Kirkripple still in Frisco hanging out with the 2022 Tundra. This one is a little bit special. This is the Platinum. Let's get into it. Now this Platinum has more surprises on, on it for me than even the TRD Pro did. We've seen the TRD Pro in uh, some images that Toyota has given us, but this one is, is quite surprising to me in a lot of different ways. We're gonna start with the front. This grill is unique to the Platinum. This grill pattern is very elaborate. We have sparkly, like gun finished gray here, matte silver plastic grill that I'm gonna call this the, uh, I don't know, dragonfly swallower grill. But this is very ornate, very elaborate, and uh, give it to Toyota, no. Blue outline on the Tundra looks really weird on the logo. That's because this is a hybrid. Of course, we have the camera right under it. Tundra paint matched here. And the TRD Pro, that's all matte black. And on the TRD Pro, you have that large LED strip there. Now, as we, we go back, this does have the premium lights, the functional grill right below those beautiful lights. And the, this has the 20 inch wheels on it, uh, a little bit bigger than what we see on the TRD Pro, but they're still, I mean, they look really, really good with this dark blue, this metallic midnight blue color. Now platinum, there you see a large and in charge here on the door. No one's gonna think it's anything else. No one's gonna think you're a TRD Pro or anything like that. However, this was a surprise to me. The iForce Max, is on the hood. You have those elaborate, I mean, these are just plastic. These are not functional in any means, but more detail, more focus on this hybrid model, even on the top of the hood. And as we go to the side, you see 360 camera. These are paint matched mirrors. On the TRD Pro, they were blacked out. And underneath, like I said, there's a, there's a camera underneath. 360 camera, you'll have all sorts of um, backing up features with your, your trailers and such. Now, the fender arches, are not the tactical camo like we see on the TRD Pro. They're a glossy black on this platinum trim. Sequential turn signals on the rear here, triple beams, and then Tundra stamped into the back, uh, similar to how TRD Pro is stamped into the back on the TRD Pro model, of course. I'm gonna flip this down. Again, the, the composite bed here. Now this has a pretty long bed on it. This looks like the six and a half foot bed. So you can get this probably in the five and a half foot bed. Uh, and the Crew Max, which you're seeing here is a larger four door model. There's also uh, a smaller four door, four door model, which you'll be able to get an eight foot bed on. And uh, if we look, this is cool. So if you look here at the bottom, or on the side of the light, I should say, that's gonna fold down the tail, uh, the tailgate, very sturdy tailgate. There's also a step here, this is an accessory. This, this will actually fold out when you press this button. It's just deactivated right now. We have a single tip exhaust, no accessories here. You can get that chrome plated if you want. Uh, I'll show you that on a different model, the 1794 model. And we're gonna fold this back up, really lightweight tailgate, very easy to fold up. And at the bottom of the truck, there are actually uh, electronic running boards that pop out. And we're gonna get on the inside get on the inside of the Platinum. Now, before you even sit in here, we have this blue uh, divoted seat here, this leather seat. So I haven't seen that, and it's kind of like this starry pattern where the stars fade onto the seat. Pretty cool detail, like I'm really just blown away by the detail they put into this Tundra. And the steering wheel here, very similar to the TRD Pro, it just doesn't have the TRD Pro logo on the bottom or the fancy stripe at the top, but it feels very similar to the DR, TRD Pro. And as we get in, oh, that is a great sounding door thud. Very, very sturdy. Feels like you're getting into a tank. Uh, folding mirrors, controls, uh, memory seats as well. Stitching, now this has a soft touch top. When I was in the TRD Pro, it was uh, hard touch. So in this Platinum model, not only do we have stitching that runs across the top here, that beautiful blue stitching that matches uh, the seats and the blue stitching on the seats, but it's soft touch as well. Super cool. Now, also soft touch behind the steering wheel on the dash all the way across. Um, now, in the TRD Pro, we have large Tundra, uh, large Toyota letters right here, but on this model, it says Platinum right at the edge. Giving that unique distinction to each grade is really, really cool. And on the 1794 model, you have wood here and that unique uh, 1794 edition at the edge too. Now this model also has the panoramic sunroof, 
which let's just watch it open up. I haven't seen it yet, so it's pretty cool to see it with you guys for the first time. Really, really cool. You can see the sunshades in the rear on this top of the line. Decorated headrest, very high quality. This 14 inch screen is out of this world. Cannot wait to see it in the new Tundra. Cannot wait, cannot wait to see it in multiple Lexus products as well. We first saw this 14 inch screen debut uh, in the Lexus NX. So that will be coming this fall as well. We have 360 camera on here. It's gonna do its little walk around my other camera with the gimbals out there so it accurately shows that. We can change our truck color if we want. Army green is there. That looks like the TRD Pro color or it could be the, uh, the red color. But let's just go back to blue. Pretty, pretty neat. Now, this also has a heated and ventilated seats. This is really decked out. This is going to be for charging in your phone as well as Android Auto, Apple CarPlay, which is wireless. You have a wireless charger down here. Here's your 360 camera, uh, con trailer controls, ride height adjustment. You have ride height adjustment on some of the higher levels, which is going to only affect the rear. So you can put it in automatic. And it'll automatically adjust the height depending on the weight of the the trailer you have behind it and then manual if you want to manually lower or heighten the rear really really cool i cannot touch this so i, I can't show you what this is all about but obviously that's uh, for your trailer controls the shifter here isn't as ornate as it is in the trd pro that's so far that's the only thing in here that isn't quite up to the same level as the trd pro uh, this will op open up to show you some cup holders tucked away. USB-C, USB-A. Again, that blue stitching on the armrest with this matte finish here looks really cool. Slidey tray for your, I don't know, phones if they're not already sitting up there. We open this. There's a button here to open it also on this side. And then lots of storage in the armrest here. Drive modes, sport, normal, and eco. Here's your towing button. And on the TRD Pro models, you have some additional controls here as well. Now here's your 12 inch screen. You can see Sport S, Sport Plus. What does that mean? Well, Kirk, that sounds like a Lexus. You're right, because this has adaptive variable suspension equipped on it. So that's only available on this Platinum and I believe the 1794 model. Uh, so those are those are unique to the higher trims of this Tundra. You cannot get adaptive vari variable suspension on the TRD Pro or the SR5 or the SR, for example. But this 12-inch screen looks really cool. And I love the fact in the hybrids, you see the max gauge. It also will give you the battery charge level of your nickel metal hydride battery that sits underneath the rear seat. You also have the boost gauge of the twin turbo v6 super cool i nerd over that stuff and i'm glad that it's readily available on this screen now there are different startup screens here and the steering wheel just moved out of the way so you have easy access for the steering wheel and let's see what this startup is beautiful we have five different state parks for the startup i haven't seen them all yet so let's just uh cycle through let's see if we can get a different one Oh yeah, there's a different one. That looks like the Redwood Forest that I test drove uh, the Hyundai Santa Cruz in. So super cool, five different national forests. And that'd be cool with over the air updates if they can add more uh, to that, that'd be cool. I'm, I, Toyota has not confirmed that, but I'm just saying Toyota, if you're less listening. Oh, we have a welcome screen here. I'm not gonna enter my phone number. Uh, yes, let's see what this is gonna take us. So I don't think we're gonna be able to see the navigation, but I promise you, this screen is lightning fast, loads really quick. The, the resolution's top notch and it's just gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. It is not rotated towards me. It's very neutral here, surrounded by the vents, very large vents, and I cannot wait for those vents to be blowing air on me uh, when I do eventually test drive this vehicle in San Antonio. So you know how I was talking about the steps on the side of the truck? Well, there's an auto feature here and there you go. You can easily turn them off if you want. And you can flip them out if you want as well to make it easier to get in and out of which i've actually found them very very useful and i'm six foot one and it's still hard for me to slide off the seat and come out but with this step gate or this step here very very useful to pull yourself in and just to get out now get into the back seat of this platinum model no surprise heated and ventilated seats you have your two charging points back here with the standard household plug-in uh beautifully stitched uh, map pockets here that's something i didn't see on the trd pro model and just gorgeous blue stitching here on this rear sun shades more stitching here on the door panels this truck is really really high quality this must have the optional jbl sound system 
the 12 speakers uh, littered throughout the vehicle, which is fine by me. Cup holders here and uh, the same detail on these seats with the blue uh, stitching and also the blue inserts on the perforation. Just really, really good looking model here from Toyota. More models coming to you from this hockey rink in Frisco with the TRD Pro, the Platinum, the 1794, the SR5. Can't wait to show you them all. See you in the next one.